these five amazing ios 18.4 features were not covered by apple officially nor many youtubers spoke about them so in this video let me take you through these five cool features of ios 18.4 for your iphone so let's start number one swipe to clear in app switcher all right guys it will be a complete time saver for you all because till now if you remember whenever you tried closing applications on your iphone that time in an app switcher we can close only one application at a one time but guys now it has changed forever in an app switcher now you can close multiple application at the same time with a two finger swipe or a three finger swipe you can close two or three application at the same time so just go ahead tap your fingers three fingers swipe up that many application will be closed on your iphone in a app switcher a time saver and a great feature second one will be your dynamic wallpaper brightness so guys ever noticed after ios 18.4 your wallpaper looks slightly dull in low power mode don't worry it's not a auto brightness or your iphone issue it's a new update or a new feature in ios 18.4 where it will automatically dim your wallpaper based upon your low power mode on or off so it's trying to consume your power in your iphone whenever you enable the low power mode a simple tweak but very powerful and really helpful with your brightness because your brightness also consumes your battery power on your iphone so whenever you enable low power mode actually dimming your brightness on your iphone will surely help your low power mode to more efficient or more effective number three smarter spotlight suggestions i am damn sure this will surprise you or amaze you so guys first of all this option available whenever you enable siri suggestions on your iphone whenever you swipe down a finger on your iphone home screen that time the spotlight appears to search anything across your iphone before that you will see on a top your iphone recommends applications to you right now here is the main game or main feature appears now your iphone got way smarter because the app recommended to you on your spotlight will be based upon your habit sharing my personal experience in morning i used to open twitter first then the instagram and now surprisingly whenever in morning i open my iphone i swipe down to search a application automatically twitter appears first then the instagram so your iphone is learning your habits of your applications so based upon that automatically the recommendation appear in the apps also the spelling errors so whenever i am searching for a application if i misspell the application for example if i want to open say instagram i just type say indagram or anything like that automatically your iphone will recommend it and it will try to give you the correct applications or recommendation in the spotlight so your iphone is getting more smarter day by day with your habits with the new updates number four some face id tweaks so guys trust me face id got quite a upgrade it faster and now more forgiving with your wrong angles for unlocking your iphone if you don't believe me earlier to unlock your iphone your iphone had to be perfectly placed in front of your face right to match your eye contact or your face but now with a cross angle also you can unlock your face id i recently discovered it and tried to unlock my phone by keeping it aside by my lap side okay and try to look at my phone screen automatically it unlocked also for a record i made a video of that while doing it and lastly number five that is your haptic feedback changes so guys actually it's not a feature which you can see but actually a feeling because haptic feedbacks is a feeling you feel while using it so basically here recently apple changed few haptic feedback patterns for multiple applications or while using it for example facetime your notifications also siri now haptic feedbacks are more smoother more refined because earlier haptic feedbacks were just hard vibrations but now they are quite smoother 
and feel good whenever there is a haptic feedback on your iPhone. This you will feel while ending a call or setting disable enable that time whenever haptic happens you will feel it quite more often and mostly on a new models like 15 16 devices this feature you won't feel it or you won't see it until you do it or actually there is a haptic feedback on your iphone happens for an instance so friends that's it five amazing unspoken features of ios 18.4 on your iphone and guys also one request if you know any feature of ios 18.4 which is still not covered by anyone or many people then please comment below we'll try to cover it in coming video or others can see it as well until then i hope you like the video and if yes please give a like and subscribe until then thank you very much see you in the next one